Alright guys, this is Mithril, back with day number 9 of the Melee Amara playthrough. And let's see here, what did we get last time? Here are all my Psycho Stabbers, my Face Puncher, which I need a new one, my Old Unpaler, I got this Class Spot, the Unleashed Dragon, the Hex, I got all these weapons I can't use. I did the Revenge of the Cartels event, got super unlucky and no Fish Slap. I got a Watson not gonna use it though uh more grenades i got some class mods i do have a phase zerker but i don't have rush any like rush stacks because i'm not really invested into the blue skill tree as you guys can see so that doesn't help me right now i was told the muse is probably going to be the best i need to sell some stuff because some of this stuff needs to go well anyways here is the build nothing in blue I am going down the red or orange skill tree to get sustainment. Depending on how many levels I have left, I will go down further on the green tree. Maxed out on purple. No guardian rank because, uh, you know, these are pretty high and it will just influence the game too much. So I have it off. Mayhem 11. And since we are here on Sanctuary, of course, let's change our look up. What's going to look good? Yeah, sure, the Psycho Mask. And then we could switch it to... This one. Alright, let's continue on with today's a video. It looks like if you save and quit and then come back on this mission, the video is not there. Which is kind of odd, but, uh, you know. A BL3 classic, if you know what I mean. Let's do a little ties that bind. Go, come on. Alright, that did pretty good damage. I need to switch back over to fire, though. Level up. Okay, let's see. Anything down here for melee? Bullets, mag size. Whenever Mara triggers an elemental effect, they explode. Yeah, let's put a point into here and see how it does. I mean, why not, right? Legendary? The companion, huh? I need to actually sell all of this junk. I need to do that as soon as I see a vendor. Legendary. Ooh, a blood letter. Level up. Let me just hit this. Oh, too much. All right. This does work. Sure, let's put it in here. How many more? Three more points? Okay. Come on, jump on down. Please? Please jump. There we go. Oh, and what did we get? A hornet. Not too bad, but you were mainly just for XP. Level up. We are... So close. Two more levels. Well, I think it'd be three more now, right? Because I need one point to actually put inside it. Okay, I need a better shield. Do any of these have Roid on them or no? Nope. All right, let's just go for the one with the highest capacity, which is going to be probably you. Oh, hold on. Need to sell all this junk. Nah, let's get rid of the Watson. I'm gonna leave this, I believe. I don't need this one. I don't need this one. Brad, shock, corrosive. I don't need the blood letter. I will save the phase zerker. I'll get rid of that. I don't need this. 
Don't need that. I'll save that. I'll save that. Okay. Now we can finally buy this. Because the unpaler is just no longer working for us. Even though it does give us melee damage, it's just too low, you know, capacity. And we just keep dying. Oh my god. Two anointed tanks and two anointed militants. This is going to be a rough little section here. You know what? We're just going to run. Run away. Look at these guys. They're spawn camping me. What is this? Call of Duty? This is ridiculous. Level up. Oh, please. I don't know if this game has a level up bonus for damage, but if it does, I'm going to use it right now. Come on, just die. No, don't do this phase. Seriously, I hate when they do this phase. Whew. Okay. I need three more. So let's put another in infusion. What did we get over here? Boxy's endowment, whatever. Another phase zerker. Does have weapon damage. And a plague bearer. Ooh, pretty nice. Love to see the plague bearer. A cutsman. The cutsman is actually still pretty good. It's just been like overshadowed by a lot of uh, other SMGs. Since we're here, we're going to be farming El Dragon Jr. Whether it be for a stopgap or another Unleashed the Dragon, doesn't really matter to me because the sub passives on this could be increased. And then a stopgap is just good because it's a stopgap. Oh, it's Fish Lap. I didn't know he can spawn from the, uh, you know, the people. Let's see, did he drop it? A Watson, a Super Ball, and a... Oh, a red card. He did not drop it. Dang it. We got a Unleashed Dragon. Nice. And the sub-passives have increased by a lot, it looks like. Let's see, 35, 16. Yeah, they basically doubled. All right, let's put that on. So that's going to be good. Although... I'd rather have, you know, the fire damage instead of the fire resistance. Oh, well, I'm still farming a stopgap, so I may get another one. Okay, this one is much worse. Because it has no melee damage. I'm not going to pick it up, and what's this? Okay, I'm not going to pick that up either. Oh, hey, a grease trap. And a rhina. Wow. I think that's the first Rhina I've seen in a long time. What's this? Oh, White Elephant. I actually wanted one of those because it goes well with the uh, Base Puncher. Okay, we're going to take that for Grave Ward. Level up. One more level. Let's put it in Infusion. Fist over matter. And constantly smash the area. I think I'd rather use ties that bind, but something to think about. Okay, here's a stopgap. The anoint isn't very good. But I'll take it. Alright, now that we got that done... I have all of the decoder rings ready. So let's go back to the villa and, you know, do that. And hopefully, if we pray, get a fish slap. That's not the fish slap. That's the needle gun. Where the heck is this person? 
Are they stuck inside the wall? Oh, yeah, I guess they were. Oh, there they are right there. Not sure how he got stuck in there, but he wasn't supposed to be in there. Level up. Can we finally? We can. One point there. Oh, look at that glorious healing. As long as I can get the damage on, the healing is going to be so good. All right, so far, this fight has been going so much better than last time. Like, it's not even close. I mean, look at that. Look at my health. Watch it down there when they hit me. Oh, no. When I can actually hit him. But you guys saw that. It just restored it right away to max. And he is dead. Whew. Okay. Let's check the loot now. Grease trap. Launch pad. Oh, it's only loot expanding. Rectifier. Safeguard. Jericho. Aha! There it is. A fish slap. Okay, so we're going to take that. And a red card. So this gives me cryo. That doesn't give me anything. Uh, corrosive? I mean, the fish slap itself is cryo. Hmm. Okay. Now I need to go back to Sanctuary and increase my grenade SDUs. Let's see, how many can I buy? I got 10 million. I bought nine of them. Okay. That's pretty good. Let's see. How does it do? 14 million? 12 million I saw over there too? Alright. Not too bad. I guess it is better the action skill and anoint is also better yeah because I'm not really using the phase grasp right now so let's put this on man that's still not the one I want but it is actually better so let's put that on all right, this is going to be my last run. If we don't get it, we don't get it. Yeah, let's play ball. Come on, let's see. And nope. We did not get it, but we did level up. Let me get the rings. Do I want to put another point here? It could be nice having double the life steal. Or this could be nice too. Actually, now that I think about it. Hmm. Let's put one into here. Just for the chance. Now, this is going to be a good gauge of how the fish slap actually does. Come here, Billy. Oh, yeah. That did pretty good. Level up. All right, let's put a second one into sustainment. I probably won't put any more in there. I think 8% should be good enough. If I really have to, I could always just respect. It's not a big deal. Let's see, I'm 65. What can I get to with seven more levels? Nothing down here. Splash damage, max health could be good. I can put something in here. Put a point in there. 
That doesn't help me. Maybe do harm? Hmm. I'll have to think about it. Legendary. Two legendaries. A dragon. Her action skill augment is triggered. Oh, actually, now that I think about that. What's my augment? Oh, the singularity. That's not interesting enough to use. That doesn't help me. Or maybe it could, actually. Because it does increase the cooldown per enemy killed. What are the passives? Action skill cooldown rate is like the best one on there. What's mine now? Max health. I mainly use this for the illuminated fist. Should we give it a try? Give it a shot and see how it does? Oh, a rose and thorns. That's a good one. Okay, nothing I can do about that. Uh, it's just unfortunate when that stuff happens. Level up. Oh, I'm still not really sure what I want to do. It would have been nice to get down here for this one, but it's just too far away now. So I guess let's do another in here. What is it? A shooting star? All right. We will take that. That's going to be useful later on for Grave Ward. Level up. You know what? Let's put some points into do harm. What is this? Another shooting star? Yes, it is. Level up. Let's do another in do harm. Okay, is that a face puncher? Yes, it is. Oh, I think I saw it say it consumes two ammo per shot. Oh, it does. I do not want that. I'm going to put it on because it is better, but I do not want a two ammo per shot face puncher. That is not what I want. Okay, this one is not times two. Oh no, my kill skill has run out. Oh, come back. This is why I hate times two. Oh, that sucks. Okay, let's grab it. Yes, it does a less damage, but that is A-OK -okay with me. Come on. Let's grab it. All right, now let's go back. Well, all right, guys, that's going to be the end of today's video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe because it will help my channel. And I will appreciate it like always. And then we are getting somewhat close to the end of the playthrough. So let me ask you, what do you want the end game to be? Do you want me to do uh, Malawan Takedown? Do you want me to do all the trials? I don't know what else you want me to do. I mean, I could do the DLCs, but if I don't have to go in them, I don't really want to, if that makes sense. Like, there's not a need to go in them. But, uh, yeah. Let me know you know, down in the comments below. And then, uh, yeah, I hope to see you guys uh, next time. Huh. Someone give me a hug.